Insurance companies evaluate your claim based upon what we call economic damages, meaning the amount of your medical bills, the amount of your future medical bills, the amount of your past lost wages, and the amount of your future lost wages. I don't agree with that. I think your case should be evaluated and you should receive what's fair. If an 18 year old boy loses his hand and incurs $5,000 in medical bills and has never had a job, is his case only worth ten dollars to $15,000? That's not fair. I believe that you should evaluate your case based upon your loss, not based upon strictly your economic damages. I had a case <clears throat> in which an 18-year-old boy lost his finger in a chainsaw because somebody else cut it off. The insurance company believed because his medical bills were minimal compared to the injury, that his, his claim was only worth $100,000. My response was to the insurance adjuster, if he really thought a finger was worth $100,000, he could just come on down to my office and I could cut off his finger and pay him $100,000. The reason why I say that is, obviously, your injury is important to you. To the insurance adjuster or the insurance company, they don't look at you as a person. They look at you as a statistic and a number. In choosing an attorney, I think it's important to find somebody that's going to look at you as an, and treat you as an individual and not just a statistic or number.